Hey, welcome to Miss Download. I'm Cheryl Poirier. Okay, here we are again in Macworld, meaning I need my hazmat suit as to not contaminate this computer with my PC germs. I'm not going to lie, I'm beginning to like this suit. It's kind of easy on my wardrobe. Let's talk about organizing your desktop for a second. If you've been looking for a more advanced version of the OS X dock, then I should introduce you to DragThing. Traditionally, the Mac dock gives you a quick access to your applications in some folders. It's kind of limiting. DragThing creates a new kind of dock which organizes your apps as well as documents, folders, and URLs. I've got mine anchored up here, but you, it's easy enough to move wherever you want to. Just hold down the option key and drag and see the little anchor is kind of swishing. It doesn't know where, where am I going to drag it? Where am I going to dock it? Where am I going to anchor it? I'm going to anchor it, you know, pretty much right there. <laughs> but that's not why they call it drag thing. The dragging refers to the ease of adding new content to your doc. Say you'd like to add an important document to the documents tab. Simply drag it from here go to documents and you can drop it you can drop it anywhere I could drop it over here I'm gonna drop it down in this corner just to be different and done double click on the document and it opens just like that <laughs> hey he's got a cooler hazmat suit than I do his is a beaver <laughs> if you right click on the doc you'll actually access all of the options. Now, as with most programs, you can change the skin, color, text type, and even add your very own hotkeys. By right-clicking, it also gives you the option to clean up the dock to its smallest possible size, like right there. You can even make notes by clicking on Make New Text Clipping, right here. And can I make a text clipping, Paul? Yes. Okay, I'm going to write. Sorry, Paul, I had to touch your Mac. My apologies. And it is done. Now, if I open up my applications, there's my text clipping. Sorry, Paul, I had to touch your Mac. <laughs> now, what I've been showing you is the master doc. Drag thing also comes with a mini bar. No, not like the ones in Vegas, rather a convenient box that shows you what programs you currently have running. Now, DragThing is free to download and try. However, if you like it and you want to support the developers, you can donate $29. I think it's well worth it. So check out DragThing for Mac because, hey, it's Mac and it's cool. Be sure to check out my archived episodes at butterscotch.com and then head on over to hover.com because it's the easiest way to purchase a domain name. And if you use the promo code at the bottom of the screen, you get 10% off your next domain registration. Take care, enjoy your Mac, and we'll see you soon.